Our goal is to create a more significant place for our products as mainstream ingredients in the domestic market. From a marketing standpoint, I think about positioning. How can we position peas and lentils to be more convenient to consumers? How can we position them from a health aspect and also from a taste and feel aspect? So, you know, just to reiterate here, peas, lentils, and chickpeas have an incredible macronutrient story. There's some great micronutrient stories to tell. You've got that low glycemic index, low glycemic load story. You know, creating something that's flavorful and craveable, creating the next Dorito, but one that's good for you, you know, here's a, here's a great opportunity. And see how the vines look big one? There's one up there. I like the, um, the fact that you balanced a little bit of lecture and education along with some fun hands-on things, because I think when you, you know, when we actually can get in there and work with some of the items that it really brings everything to life. Uh, the thing I like most about the course is that we have uh, a good compilation of lectures which are sharing practical information mm -hmm. that we can use it for uh, applied research, uh, basically developing uh, products for uh, uh, large markets. Some of the helpful benefits from the nutritionist and what she explained, some of the other speakers, uh, the PhDs, who are able to explain more of the technical background of what the components in the, uh, in the legumes are and how they have helpful benefits. And I think it's really important in today's market that we do all we can as developers to try and utilize those helpful benefits to put more healthy products on the market. You've given us a basic uh, uh, that this is a crop that comes from close to the earth. It has a lot of vitamins, minerals, rich in protein, and that's easy to work with. I would say I also enjoyed the hands-on, and I enjoyed the discussion between the uh, leaders and other fellow students. The two or three things I, I, I love that one, it was hands-on and we got to work with the different products because they're not things that you see all over or they're not, you know, you have to special order them or get them in, so there's, you got to work with stuff that you wouldn't normally get to do. Well, we had so many applications and, and as you said, I've been doing this for a long time and I grew up in a country that we use a lot of legumes, chickpeas especially, and lentils. Uh, the new applications that we saw over here not only use as a thickening, or binding agent that we all know as far as soup goes and on and on and so forth but the application of the flour itself. And so being able to look at being able to do a gluten-free product and create a bread that actually tastes like bread, reacts like bread, is wonderful for us because now we can look at this incorporated into the work we're doing and hopefully be able to launch a product that's going to do exceptionally well in a national chain. I made some pie dough. I made some uh, cookie dough and then of course I used it in the bread and then we used it here today to make a lot of different breads and, and the attendees did a lot of different work with the bread that was unique. The breads and the cookies, you can really taste the differences in the, the different flours. That's the one I learned the most because you can totally see the organoleptic properties of every flour and plus the chefs are there and anybody that's sponsoring, just answering your questions and you just get enriched by everybody's comments. It provides a great you know, forum for discussion. Uh, a lot of energy, uh, people that had knowledge of what they were doing as well as uh, things that are you know, applicable now, especially for manufacturers like us. Um, the flavors of the food. Uh, another thing was uh, the recipes were not boring. It had a lot of flavor, which is important in our world. So it's good to see that uh, once again, well thought out recipes that we could actually duplicate here in the kitchen. So. I think they're leaving today with a great takeaway. They, they're not only leaving with more knowledge about the product itself, where to get, and the different types of items that are out there, but with different applications, with different ways that they can incorporate down their cooking. It's just been great. It's been a great experience.